bum bum da 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 hey shysters it's me okay let's go on through the second half of snowden Ooh, another puzzle but what's down here it's a snow papyrus it's a lump of snow with the word sans written on it in red marker Aw, Sans, come on, you're more than that. <laughs> Jeez, it's been a while since I've been in this game. There we go. Bridge. Motherfuckers. Da 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 What's up? I don't know. But wait a minute, what? Say, are you following me? Ah! Oh, gift trot. Um, let's check. Some teens decorated it as a prank. Get this off of me! Do -do -do. Ow. There we go. That's a little better. Keep getting this shit off. That's a little better. It has a dog in it! Get the fucking dog off. Oh, wait, it's been lifted. You know what? Here, have a gift. Aw, you shouldn't have. There we go. There we go. Just check here. Ugh. Okay, let's go. You sure do like to exercise. Are you lost? I... What? Okay, I'll go away now. Ugh, lovely Pepsi. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold! A snow puff. Eh? There's 30G inside this. What is this? Woof. What a tiny doghouse. Oh, goody. A snow puff. Tail. Oh, it's a cute little doggy. Oh, it's adorable. Ah, shit. It's the greater dog. So many dog faces. Come here, little puppy. Don't move and the puppy won't wake. Here you go, little puppy. <laughs> Don't move and the puppy won't hurt you. Let's play! Let's play! You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It's flat on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Have some pets. I still have not pet enough. <laughs> Spare it, spare it, god damn. 
Ugh, dear God. When I play Undertale, I like to drink a nice refreshing can of Pepsi. Please give me money. <laughs> Please. Anyway, let's keep it going. Dun 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 dun. Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge! Behold! The Gauntlet of Deadly Terror! Oh my god, they have a dog! When I say the word, it will fully activate! Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice! Each part will swing violently up and down! Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain! Are you ready? Because I am about to do it! Well, well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now. That, uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, may be too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Heh. Heh. I don't know what my brother's gonna do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Welcome to Snowden Town. Na, 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 na. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Lovely. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? So. Huh? Sell some? Does this look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works where you come from, but... If I started spending money on old branches and used bandages, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. Uh... Give me the bandana. I'll wear the bandana. Get rid of this friggin' ribbon. Oh, the end. Mum says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. What's maximum HP? Welcome to Snowden, Snowden's premier hotel. One night is 80 gold. Well, this is not fun. Hiya! You look like you had a great sleep, which is incredible because you were only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. Thanks. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. Tee hee! Bun 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 bun. Bun, 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 bun. I think I figured it out. No, never mind. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Wonder if that weird skeleton is an adult or a kid. Okay, then. Mm -hmm. Library. Okay. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. This mailbox is labeled Papyrus. Look inside? Sure. It's empty. Oh, Papyrus, no! Poor Papyrus.
Jeez. Oh no. Human, allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another's puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings. <laughs> they must be what you are feeling right now. Um. Oh, shit. <laughs> I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the Great Papyrus, will be your... No, no, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. He likes to say, yeah ha ha What? F flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings? Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. I have zero redeeming qualities. Oh no, that humility. It reminds me of myself. You're meeting all my standards. Ugh, my throat. <clears throat> Let's see later, after I capture you. Boy, you ain't gonna capture me with those attacks. I will not fight. So you won't fight. Then, let's see if you can handle my flavored blue attack. Yeah! <sighs> Excuse me. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Where'd the music go? Oh shit! You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> You're blue now. Let's date later, after I capture you. Ba -da 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 this is the point of the fight against him now. You are blue, so... I can't go with the music. Anyway, our heart is blue now, which means we are subject to gravity. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. So we gotta jump to dodge the bones. to make me use my special attack. Boing. I can almost taste my future popularity. Papyrus, head of the Royal Guard. Ow. Woo! Papyrus, unparalleled spaghetti! Nope. Nope. And nope. Oh. Nope. Ooh. Nope. <laughs> Undyne will be really proud of me. Wee! 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 Ah, oh, my face! The king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile. I wish someone would do that for me. My brother will... Well, he won't change very much. Boop. I'll have lots of admirers, but... Most of this fight is just going to be me singing along to the music if I don't keep talking. Okay, so, Papyrus. This dude is... I forgot to freaking read his thing. 
I think he asked if anyone will like him as much as we do. Mm -mm. I don't know, you gotta, you gotta try to get yourself out there, dude. Someone like you is really rare. Aw, oh, thanks so much. I'm so unique, aren't I? Wee! 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 And dating might be kind of hard. Oh! After you're captured and sent away, we can do long distance, whatever. Ah, my. everything! Ah, who cares? Give up! Never! Never, never give up! Give up or face my special attack! No! How about we not and say we did? <laughs> Ow. I will become most popular of all time. And must become a royal guardsman so all the monsters for me will simply fall into line. Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. Dude, just freaking use it. Ow. Not too long and I will use that special attack. Papyrus, you're killing me with the suspense. Oh, oh, ah! Virus remembered a bad joke Sans told and is frowning. No, he's not. No. This is your last chance before my special attack. Behold my special attack! It's a dog! What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Oh well, I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Okay. Here's an absolutely normal attack. Woo! Woo! Oh crap, I couldn't prepare. Could not prepare for that. <laughs> Oh, oh, dog, cool, dude, bone, up, all the way up I go, Ugh. damn, ow. Well, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. No, I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend Quantity will remain stagnant. Let's be friends, motherfucker. <laughs> really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess, I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowie, we haven't even had our first date, and I've already managed to hit the friend zone. Milady, <laughs> Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like you! That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To 
To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is... well... He's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> oh, Jesus, I need a drink. Okay, let's go have that date. Bum bum. Oh, I have to turn the mic off for a bit. Okay, sorry about that. I'm back now. That was a cool little Easter egg I showed off, where if you keep moving back and forth between the kitchen and the rest of the room, Virus soon enough says he can't feel his legs. <laughs> There's just spaghetti in that fridge and the dog's in there. Let's just finish this off so I can finish the episode. That's my room. If you finish looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. Go inside. Yeah. 
Hey! Those are all the attacks I used on you! Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday, even though it basically just happened. Let's just start the date. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay! Dating start! Boop! Here we are, on our date. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry, you can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Oh god. Let's see. Step one, press the C key on your keyboard for dating HUD. I think you already did that. Wowie, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Step two, ask them on a date. Ahem. Your man, I, the Great Papyrus, will go on a date with you. Sure. Really? Wowie! I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning? No. Despite that, you chose to wear clothing today of all days? Was your interest in me predestined? No, your dating power! Okay. Nyeh! Nyeh! Don't think you've bested me yet! I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating, and I never will! I can easily keep up with you! You see, I too can wear clothing! In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Yeah. What do you think of my secret style? I absolutely friggin' hate it. No! Your honesty! It shows how much you really care! <laughs> However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid! Boy. This date won't escalate any further. Unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. My hat. I was... I inspected your face. My hat. My hat. Yeah! Ooh, a present. Well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. I won't open it. You can't even bring yourself to harm my delicate wrapping. No, that technique. It's too strong. Counterattack. I'll open the present myself. Do you know what this is? No idea. Yeah. That's right. You have no idea. Though this appears to be spaghetti. This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask, then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Yo, man, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking, and by extension, me. Maybe even more than I do. Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um, boy, is it hot in here or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. Well, better than my dating skills. <laughs> I would be able to match your passion for me. I mean, I won't blame him. 
He tried. Alas, I, the great papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. Okay. A dark prison of passion with no escape. He could be a pretty good poet. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Your man, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> Bye. Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Well, gotta go. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Do -do 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 -do. Derp, derp, derp. <laughs> Let's move on. At the next save point, I'll go ahead and end the episode. Jeez. Bum, 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 bum. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. I do. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video and you want to see more, be sure to leave a like. Share us with your friends on Facebook and Twitter. Check the links in my channel description to go to my Facebook, my Twitter, a Discord chat where you can chat with me and other subscribers at any time, and a Patreon page so that you can donate money every month to help the channel grow. Even $1 a month helps. And you can always subscribe. If you do subscribe, be sure to hit that bell icon so you can stay notified. Thank you all so much for watching. See you next time.